All right, everyone, and welcome back to the Every Aspiration Challenge. We are in part five, and when we last left our hero, he had finally unlocked grilled cheese. And right now, we're just kind of chipping away at the soulmate aspiration. Um, we we had our two, we earned our silver on two dates, and we'd already achieved soulmate relationship because we're that awesome. Um, we also have a tiny house, which makes it extremely easy to do that. So now we have to have two more gold level dates and we have to perform just a bunch more romantic gestures. We actually knocked out 34 of these on the first date. So booyah for that. And then I think, so we also unlock grilled cheese. And what we have to do, eat 10 excellent grilled cheese, cook three group servings of grilled cheese sandwiches, talk to five different students about grilled cheese. Maybe we'll work on that too, because that seems relatively easy. Um, we're not gonna get the challenge we're not gonna hit the challenging ones so we have to eat a grilled cheese in space and talk to grim reaper which means we'll have to murder someone and i'm not sure i'm in a murdery type mood yet i don't know that could change depending on how far we go um as a quick recap from last time we also unlocked um we also have two new I'll say unlocked i didn't unlock well everyone unlocked them with the patch update but we also um have the new patch update i think that's thing new at this point I can't, I'm, I'm a hot mess today, y'all. Um, we have the patch update, I think it was from November, where we had the new neighborly advisor aspiration. So we have to successfully advise and influence the lives of other Sims, become good friends with five Sims, and then achieve level seven charisma skill. And then we also had villainous Valentine, which I think will come in handy because in order to finish the serial romantic, we're going to have to cheat on our spouse so we may try to kind of go between Villainous Valentine and uh, Serial Romantic as we as we go. But I think for right now, you know, since we're still trying to be a good husband, we are going to have some more dates with our sim. But first, it looks like we're getting a little sleepy. So we are going to actually, yeah, we're going to go to sleep. Want to go over to his house to hang out? Actually, you know what? Sure. Um, because then maybe we can woohoo, which I think will count as a romantic gesture, and then get our fun up, and then we can take him out on a date. So that sounds perfect, right? Also, I don't quite know where he lives. I believe. Where are we? I think this is Windenburg. I think this is the Crumbling Isle. So it's a cute house. But anyway, hi, hi, husband. Hi, husband. Who? We don't currently live together with, but it's fine. You know, this is a this is a new type of a um oh we can make out in the closet. Let's do that. Oh, he's got room either he has roommates or there's just some other random dude here. Alright, can we woohoo in the closet? We can totally woohoo in the closet. Yeah, let's get this fun up a bit. Also, there's a DJ booth in your bedroom. That is really weird. Some of these base, some of these houses that like Maxis gives you, have very very interesting design choices. But hey, you know what? Do what do what you're gonna do, right? All right. Can we take? Can we sleep here? Can we use this bathroom. Try to get his energy up a bit before we take Sergio out. We'll see. We'll see. All right, we're sleeping. I think that's pretty good. Also, it's also 11. It's almost midnight. Should I take him out on a date now? I'm sure we can go to like a dance club or something. Let's go to the club. Ask on date. Oh, also, I wasn't even sleeping in his bed, apparently, because you know, that's at his bedroom. Oops, that's fine. His roommates don't mind, right? Ask on date. Sergio. Tevin's still in there because I think we were trying to romance Tevin um, before we got off. We got before we got the offer to get married for money. So then Sergio was just there. So we started hitting up Sergio. All right, let's go to let's go to Discotech Pan Europa. And let's dance the night away. Let's dance our troubles away, y'all. Do do do. No, I'm lurking outside my window right now. So I'm recording the same day as I recorded part four. Um, and it is still snowing. It is the first snowfall of the year. First snowball, snowfall of the season as well. Because I am on the east coast of the U.S. And look at the 
know, three to four inches looking out my window right now. Um, I think the roads are starting to stick a little bit. Hopefully it's not too, too bad because I actually have an appointment in like an hour. I have to go get my COVID booster. Um, but no, you guys don't want to hear about that. You all want to see... You all want to see uh, Sam and Sergio. I almost forgot my Sim's name. Oh, my God. Y'all want to see Sam and Sergio woohoo in a closet. I mean, I know I do, right? Yeah. All right. Let's go. Oh, he's sleepy. That's fine. I mean, this will probably make us both, like, super flirty. So, because we need to get gold. Oh, oh, you guys are downstairs. Okay. Where are you? There you go. We're also getting a little hungry. Let's do all right. If this doesn't get him, if this doesn't get them both flirty at the same time, I don't know what will. At least I'm flirty. All right, woohoo! Boom! We did it. Cool. I mean, oh, oh, he's so filthy right now. Oh, he's a dirty boy. All right. I don't know. Let's kiss him. Kiss. Yeah, I know. I know, but I'm willing to look. I'm willing to look beyond that. That sounds some really ominous music play. All right, can we sit and chat here? Oh, can we not? Why is this room locked? Okay, for some whatever reason, like, this door was just, like, locked by default. I, okay, but anyway. Are you coming? You're supposed to sit and chat with me. We're supposed to, like, make out and stuff. Or I'm supposed to give you a massage. That's what we're doing right now. Really? Yeah, whatever. Okay. Um Romance. Uh ask for a massage. Oh no, I'm supposed to give you a massage, not Oh my god, this date's a bust. Wake your ass up, please. Is he gonna wake up? Should I have not asked him out on a date out at midnight? Probably. But we're gonna give him a massage anyway. Hopefully this will be a, a, regenerat uh, a regenerative massage. All right. Aw. that count? Sweet. All right, we still got to do a bunch of... Apparently this does not count as sitting and talking to your date, which is interesting. Maybe we actually have to have to talk. But ask him about his day. Oh, it did work. Okay. Tell him a story. Tell him a story. Tell a funny story. I don't know what's going on with this music. All It's like super ominous music going on in the background. But hey, we hit gold. We hit gold. Let's see if we can knock out these 50 romantic gestures. And by doing that, we're just going to keep kissing him. Or should we take advantage of the fact we have a closet here? Let's do some closet woohoo. Woohoo, 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 woohoo. Is that not? Are we, are we locked in here now? Come on. Okay, so I'm not sure which action like we couldn't accomplish, but whatever. Hey, we hit gold and we're only six away from performing a 50 romantic gestures. Basically, basically means we just need one more date and then we are a soulmate. So yeah, booyah for that. Sin, what's the reward? I wasn't even paying attention. Sins with the companion have special interactions with their spouse to help ease the trials of life. Aw, that's very sweet. But we're not gonna worry about that because we're gonna be dumping him shortly. All right, they're woohooing. We're gonna let them do their thing. Sam's getting a little hungry. Oh, 
Oh, the date's over. Okay, cool. It's a lost track of time. Let's go home because we are getting a little hungry. And it is 4.30 in the morning and our husband looked like he was probably about to pass out. So looking for new wall art, try the microscope or observatory to get some beautiful prints. Maybe I will. I will say we definitely need some more wall art in this game. I keep forgetting that you can just like create your own stuff. Like, but uh, I don't know. I haven't tried the um, I haven't tried the micro the microscope and all that crap yet. All right, let's go pee. Let's take a sh shower, just regular old shower. Um, let's try to vacuum up these guys, and then let's jump back over to grilled cheese. And try to get him to eat a bit. How does that sound? What's aluminum? A few meals while inspired. You know what? We should probably be doing that. But for right now, I think we're just going to make some grilled cheese. So we just need three group servings of grilled cheese. So cook. Uh, da, 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 da. I probably just went past, right past it, didn't I? Mm. Yep, there we go. I guess this family size count as a group. We're about to find out. Do if we can do is up burn in the stove now. Oh, it does count. Yay! All right, eat your grilled cheese, and then we need to cook some more. Cook, 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 cook. Real cheese, party size. This house is still a mess, and this little these little Robovacs do nothing. Whatever. All right, cook. Yeah, see, look. <laughs> I'm just gonna stop. He literally ran. It, like it's literally sitting right there. Why are you like this? Why are you like this? Okay, cook. Oh god, I just break the game. No, I did not. Good, good, good. Uh grilled cheese. Family size. Are any of these excellent? Are these all excellent? Oh, booyah. Ooh. Hell yeah. Alright. We're glutton for grilled cheese today, y'all. Gotta eat ten of these. Cause apparently they're all excellent, because I'm an amazing chef. And we gotta talk to five different Sims. No, why am I doing? Why am I doing that? What are we up to? Three? Expand this a little bit. Oh, we're halfway there. Oh, we're getting sleepy too. You're about to pass out, aren't you? Probably. How many more we got? Or only four more. You can do this. I believe in you. We'll let you do this and I'll let you go to sleep. Eating grilled cheese. Grilled cheese is amazing, by the way. I haven't had a grilled cheese in so, so long. Like, I like in real life, I mean. Like, obviously, Sam is like, oh, Tevin. Oh, so, th okay. So, this is going to sound crazy. I know we're friends and all, but, well, okay, here it is. I have a crush on you. Phew. Okay, it's out there. So, um, would you want to go out with me sometime? We're super cool. I want to hang out with you. I really want to hang out with you more. Of course. Let's go on a date. I don't think you actually have to go on a date after this. So, sure. Because we are going to need to probably go on a date with him at some point. So, but first, we have to eat our grilled cheese. All right, we good? One more. Sergio wants us to go over to his house, hang out. I mean, we just literally just saw you. And we're going to see you again, because we're going to go on another date. Oh. Well, at least he ate. At least that counts as eating the grilled cheese before he passed out. Why don't you go ahead and actually like, get in bed? We'll sleep for a bit, and then I think... I think we'll just be able to knock out our last date. All right, uh, let us wake him up. Let us have him 
use the toilet and take a steamy shower. We switch the aspiration back. Love, soulmate. Yeah, we literally just need... We need five more romantic gestures and one more gold star date. So let me let him... Oh, our house is getting stanky and dusty, but it's fine. We have, we have urgent matters at hand. Do... Taking your sweet old time. All right, let's do that. And then let's ask on date. Sergio. I keep forgetting my husband's name. I should probably remember that. All right, where are we going to go? So we had a date at the museum in Del Sol Valley. We had a date at the bar in um, Mount Comorebi. And we had a date at, in Glimmerbrook. Let's go, let's go to the beach. Let's have a beachy date. That sounds fun, right? Uh, San Simoleon Beach. So many worlds. A lot of worlds, like, I've barely explored. So this is kind of a good opportunity to do that. But first... Oh, yeah. Yeah, those grilled cheeses are starting to have an effect on us. We're starting to get a little chunky. Thankfully, there is a, um, there is a, oh, what am I trying to say? There is, I'm pretty sure it's a fitness aspiration we can work on too, but let's get into our beachy clothes and swimwear. Did it work? All right, now let's kiss his hands. Let's have a sexy pose. Let's be enticing. We only need a few more of these. Um, let's ask a risque question. And then let us be enticing again, just because it's right there. Oh, we should probably, we need to flirt with him again. Oh no, we, could, we already accomplished all the flirting, so booyah. All right. Flirt with your date while flirty. Hell yeah. Kiss your date passionately. Passionate kiss. Boom. We did our 50 romantic gestures. Nice to know that you can quantify having a soulmate like that. But, you know, as you do. Alright, let's speed this along a bit. Um, we still need to sit and talk with our date. And I think we can do that here. Sit together. And let us, oh, I need this. I like the idea of like running through this like super quickly, but then it gets a little overwhelming. So we're gonna go back to normal speed a bit. And then we're going to funny, tell a funny story. Dude, Dirk Dreamer, get the hell out of here, please. Thank you. Oh, really? Dude, I'm trying to have a romantic day here. Get the f out of here. I like be mean to him. Uh, man, I have times I just like right click and delete him. But all right, you know what? You know what, Sergio, whose name I literally just blanked on again. But though it doesn't matter because we had our gold date. Let us sit and chat here. Let's just hang out. Let's have one more nice night together. All right, Dirk Dreamer needs to like seriously needs to kiss my ass and get the hell out of here. Come on. I just want to have one more nice night with you before I probably have to break up with you. Are we doing this? Are you getting flirty with Dirk? You cheating bastard. I'm the one who's supposed to be cheating, not you. Alright, you know what? Whatever. We hit the gold. Let's just mark it as done. Ending early. Sure. But hey, look at that. We completed a soulmate aspiration. So that's uh, three down. And I want to say 54 or 56 more to go. I honestly don't remember. But um, yeah, let's go home. And then we'll go home, go to sleepies.
And... All right, it is just after midnight, in game time. Um, I think we are... Overall, we had a pretty good day. Let's clean... You know what? Let's go ahead and clean this up a bit. House of the Pigs die. Um, get rid of these dust bunnies. But no, we're doing pretty good. Um, okay, it's not... I don't understand why this vacuuming does not always work, but whatever. All right, anyway, did it work? Boom, he's gone, house is clean. Our RoboVac does nothing. So we're gonna go ahead and go to sleep. Get some sleepy time in. And I think we're gonna call it a day. So thank you all for watching the Every Aspiration Challenge. And if you like this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to the channel. Uh, one of my New Year's Asper, um, one of my New Year's resolutions is to try to uh, create a little more content for this channel. Um, in addition to my Twitch streaming, where I stream Sims building and kind of go between Sims and Hunter Baby Challenge. So please consider liking and subscribing here. Please consider checking out my Twitch channel as well. And that is it. I will talk to you all later. Hope you have a fantastic day. Bye, y'all.